the Chesapeake Bay has some health problems. But, there's a plan that's being carried out to make it healthy by the year 2025. This plan, this effort, is called the Chesapeake Clean Water Blueprint, or just the blueprint. But to make sure it happens and we get a healthy bay, we each need to do our part. First, a little history. Back in the 1970s, the Clean Water Act was passed to fix pollution problems in America's rivers. Since that law passed, lots of work has been done to fix Chesapeake Bay pollution, but it hasn't been enough. Dead zones still appear. Too much dirt or sediment clouds up the water, making it hard for underwater grasses to grow, which means less habitat and fewer fish and crabs. So because the problems hadn't been fixed back in 2010, the federal government really got down to business and started this thing we called the Blueprint to clean up the bay. So what is it? First, the Blueprint has specific goals that limit how much pollution each state can let run off into the bay. These goals are called TMDL, or Total Maximum Daily Loads. Second, all of these states whose land drains into the bay, they each made plans for how they would meet these goals. These plans are called WIPs, or Watershed Implementation Plans. Plans include things like fixing the way we treat sewage or planting trees along streams to catch runoff. Third, there's a timeline where every two years is a check-in on each state's progress up until 2025. There are consequences along the way if states miss goals. So, the blueprint is that whole process, the goals of how much pollution to cut, plans on how to cut that pollution, and a timeline for tracking progress. It's like building a house. You have the goals to do the foundation, walls, roof, plans to get materials, and timelines to make sure it all goes up in the right ways at the right time. Except, the bay faces a challenge that things like houses never do, which is that the bay is affected by all these states and involves all of us. A house doesn't have one plumber elected by people in one neighborhood and another plumber elected by people in another, with the rest of us just hoping the pipes meet each other. The only way for the blueprint to succeed is if we work together. Each state government doing its part, each county, city, each of us. Save the bay.